as opposed to heavily relying on applying pesticides with backpack sprayers carried by humans, imagine using a drone and what life becomes with the use of such technologies. All the protection that's required, the hazardous chemicals that can enter and affect the, uh, the workers on the farm. This kind of technology does away with all that because with a drone, you don't have to step in the farm. The drone does its job in the quickest time possible and the crop is properly sprayed. So we are not only... For farmers in Bamnanika, a town in Luero district, new technology affords efficiency in usage of water and pesticides, for instance. Because our horticulture products have been intercepted many times in the European Union market, one because of maximum residue levels. So in this case, where we have seen we need to calculate exact amount of pesticide we need, we think our product, if we use this technology, will come without those. I could spray my neighbor's land with, uh, within the three minutes and finished, and yet I have over 34 acres of maize. That's amazing. I can leave, I can leave Kampala any time and come from work in Kampala and come here and do it within an hour. Uh, so I feel like it's a, a technology which has to be embraced by farmers. This, this is the chemical container. At this critical point of transformation to technology for better agriculture, the cost of acquisition may be prohibitive. The key thing in this, uh, in this challenge is to have enabling uh, frameworks to uh, assist smallholder farmers, who are the majority in Uganda, to be able to, to access this kind of services as a group. The best way of, of doing that normally is through a cooperative or a farmer's business organization. So it will do the best to protect the uh, crops. Yeah, this is the, the new technology. And also, uh, the also most important thing is if we got enough batteries with one drone every day, we can operate the almost uh, uh, 50 hectares. The agriculture drone's market size is expected to grow from 1.2 billion US dollars in 2019 to 4.8 billion US dollars by 2024 at an annual growth rate of 31.4%.